Now, next week happens to be a fantastic week, and I can tell you why. Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2. Three years in the making, we cannot wait for this film to hit theatres, and we decide what better way to celebrate than to take a look at the comic book origins of these cult classic characters that were introduced to audiences around the world in 2014. So, a big thank you and a shout out to Disney Africa for making this video possible and sponsoring it. Now, let's start this video with the man that everybody knows by now, Rocket Raccoon. For a character who is usually grumpy, can't keep his hands to himself, and isn't afraid to start a fight, Rocket's origins are surprisingly goofy to say the least. Now, originally the guardian of the Keystone Quadrant, Rocket patrolled and protected a sector of space with a gang of other animal misfits. But Rocket was meant for menial labor, one of the many animals whose intelligence was increased and their bodies painfully augmented to allow them to perform tasks for their masters on Halfworld. Eventually leaving Halfworld after saving the population, or so he thought, Rocket trekked across the galaxy starting fights and earned a reputation as a fierce troublemaker. A reputation that Peter Quill made good use of when he recruited Rocket into the Guardians of the Universe, as he realized that the cranky fella had a gift for military tactics and engineering, even if he was a bit of a kleptomaniac. Here you go. Oh, I was just kidding about the leg. I just need these two things. What? No, I, th I thought it'd be funny. Was it funny? No, wait, what did he look like hopping around? I had to transfer him 30,000 units. <laughs> With a place in the team and his best friend Groot along for the ride, Rocket found some purpose in the galaxy. It was until he returned to Halfworld and found out that most of his memories were indeed fake. All the result of a grand plan by the Star Thief to earn his freedom from a planet that was designed to house the most dangerously insane criminals around. Rocket eventually defeated the Star Thief and returned to the Guardians, vowing to protect the galaxy once again. Now, not just a foul-mouthed gun expert, Rocket has an uncanny aptitude for machines and can regularly be found combining his love of weapons and engines together to devastating results. Rocket is also a born leader, having led the Guardians in the absence of Quill, achieving many victories while in command. Just don't call him a raccoon, okay? I live for the simple things, like how much this is gonna hurt. <laughs> yeah, right, little man. And there you go, that's everything that you need to know about the crew of the Milano. Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 2 is out next week, May the 5th. And if you go see that film, drop us a comment below and let us know what you think about it. That would be super cool.